Good news, my wonderful people. See what exactly happened today. You will be shocked, surprised, and you can see for yourself. Yeah? Peter Obi, Baba Hamed, Aisha Yusuf, others arrive River State today. Remember that the governor of River State, okay, the governor of River State has put a law. He has put a law that nobody, nobody should campaign. Nobody should campaign. No one should do this or do that. You know, he said nobody should campaign, you know, uh, unless he gives the order. So this is exactly what is going on now. Today, you can see for yourself that there is urgent need for urgent attention. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Peter Obi, Baba Hamed, Aisha Yusuf, others, Arise River State. See for what? Following the decision of the incumbent governor of River State, yes, on Wiki, to invite Peter Obi for the inauguration of a project in his state, pictures showing the 2023 presidential candidate with his vice presidential candidate, Yusuf Dante Baba Hamed, activist, Aisha Yusuf and other members of the Labour Party have been shared online. That is today. Recall that former 2023 presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party, Governor Yeson Wike, had few days ago announced that former Governor of Anambra State, Peter Obi, will be in River State today to commission one of the flyovers, which happens to be the ninth flyover in the states, making transportation and movement safe and very good in the state. Videos shared on the microblogging platform Twitter by a Nigerian identified as Mekwell shows the moment the Labour Party presidential candidate supporters in the state we are praising him Why Governor Yeson Wike tried to welcome him into the state. Peter B also took to his verified Twitter account to announce that he arrived the government house in Port Harcourt River State with his team for the commissioning of the new flyover constructed by Governor Yeson Wike. Nigerians are praising and calling on the Governor Yeson Wike that he should look at what is going on and speak for Nigerians as Nigerians truly sincerely want change. Nigerians want change. They should join us to implement this change, not work against us with regards to this change. We know that he's not in terms with his own presidential candidate. We are all aware. Okay, there's no hiding place in that. We all know what is going on. We all know very well. Okay, we all know. However, we can see that it is no longer business as usual. As some persons, some people are doing everything they can, okay, in their own way, in their own regards, to ensure that they are the ones he supports. But if, truly, sincerely speaking, Peter Obi wants to, you know, wants to show to Nigerians that he does love them and want to support them, then more should be done. We want to understand, you know, where he stands. Because the new um, order, executive order 22, that he has just given in the state, you know, may not work for the, 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 the obedience because the obedience are spontaneous. Obedience are spontaneous, you know. So it's easy, you know, to just go on and ensure, okay. So this is what, and ensure that, you know, they make their position known. This is what is going on. This is why every one of us, we want accord, must do everything humanly speaking possible and ensure that at the end of the day, nobody stays in one place and assume that everything will fall in place without us, you know, getting things right back on track. You know, so this is what, what is going on. This is what is going on. Can you see that, you know, the, 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 the position or the prominence of us making what is right, right is now. Let no one think that all of a sudden things will jump on board if we do nothing. Okay? So this is why every one of us needs to rise up. Every one of us needs to, you know, needs to become what we need to be. Nobody should sit back there, you know, if Nigeria is to become the nation where we don't have to, you know, start, uh, we must go and look for visa to travel. Do you know it can happen? 
not all countries not only uk america australia canada and you know some other nations are strong nations Do you know a country like you know like uh uh what's it called now uh, uh malaysia has a strong visa yeah they have a strong passport they don't need to take visa to go to uk please investigate Malaysia has a strong passport because the economy is doing, you know, they are, they are exporting, they are producing. So they are, they are, they are, whatever their currency is, is strong. Do you get me? Africa, we are so blessed. If you know the na natural resources that God has put under the soil, which we are working on. Fear of God will catch you. Fear of God will catch you. If somebody really expansions to you, Africa can be leading the world. But guess what? The powers that be will not want it. And we, the leaders we put there, sadly, they give them peanuts and they use them against their people. Hence, we are where we are. You see us oppressing our very own. Our very own. You see your, your own brother. Only use your own hand oppressor. What do you gain? And they ask you, what do you gain? Go see what you have for Satis now. Go see how many see for yourself. Best goes now, now tell you, say, a brother walking are rubbish. The same work will be say for in time. Everybody say, ah, oh guy, you too much. How person go leave office, put things properly in place. How people go leave office. Eh? Put things properly in place. Leave money for office. Make sure everything go where. How person go do this kind of thing. So you see, welcome to Nigeria. Welcome to Nigeria. Where we cannot allow the same thing to go on again and again. And remain guiltless. We cannot remain guiltless when we are supposed to be speaking. If we want to be guiltless, we just have to speak out. You cannot be guiltless when you, you know, who, who, when you when you know what you're supposed to be doing. Have you not heard of the saying that says, "Yeah, the person when you know what to do, when they correct, when they not want to him already not sin." You know, say to help this person, he correct. You're supposed to do one, but you not one. Say to you, Nassim, you never hear that matter before. You never hear that. You never hear that. Not so it be you. Not pass so, not so it be. So, every one of us, every one of us must rise up. You know, every one of us must rise up. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button. So you can get all our latest news. God bless. Have a fantastic and a lovely day. From us, it's bye for now. Remember, you have a voice. Bye-bye.